Surviving storms. Surviving storms. Surviving storms. people will be a people who come in and get their water in the suits. So that was a life saver for us, you know? And then we had the river. The river. Not a good place, but then the river was a life saver. So we took on this river. So we had to adapt. Okay? So what I find is that this creativity and I'm always in I'm in my head. I'm a person I'm in my head. Like I I like to think. So now if I have a problem I don't want to think of um, the problem too much. I'm thinking of how to solve the problem. You would say um, your connection will help you not to? My brother, I would say that is the only connection that will send me mad. Mm. Because if I did not have that, if I did not get that, um, how should I say that? The idea to turn to God, whatever it is that makes me turn to this supernatural thing they call in God, is that I make me tap into it, like to tap into that. Because I say, but. What did, what I doing wrong or what should I do or if it's something I do in my life and then I watch it happen to everybody else and I think the only way we can sometimes do things sometimes when we have a problem for me all also I find is the spiritual part of the thing because when I have something to give my daughter and I know I don't have it I do go and ask people and cry and go to human beings I go on my knees and then I tell God well look is that and look is that and help me not to do anything wrong. And since you say in the Bible that, that, and that, I'm waiting for you to make those miracles for me. So I'm waiting. And but when I'm waiting, I don't just sit down and wait, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll go and I'll watch, do what I can yeah. still again. So it's doing what you can with what you have. And not focusing on what you don't have. So yeah. I tell that to my daughter, Minka, to all the time. Minka, yesterday I was speaking to her. Do you remember me sometimes? I just feel. I say, Minka, I just feel so. But what I do is that I just reverse it and start to think of what I have. And I think they're saying that it's being thankful to God and tell God, thanks for what you have. Thank, thank you for my life and my health because I almost died. I almost died in Maria. I almost died from the heart attack. And I almost did the shoot. You understand? And none of them don't kill me because I prayed. And when I prayed, then he's showing you what to do in your mind. I don't know. Is something crazy? No. no. <laughs> no. I just no. think that's something because I just know what to do. Can you imagine? I <laughs> I, I think it was recovering, but COVID gave us a little slap. It was, it was. We were doing a little better. People might not like me saying that, but I think like after Maria, people got assistance. People were starting to get their roof back. People were starting to get on their feet. Yeah. And COVID come and just slap down the economy. That's what happened. I feel in so kind of a way the other day I go to home and I see him. And then those bus drivers had strikes. So when they had strike now, you know that gave me a slap too, because I had my class to teach on the Monday. So we can't afford, you see, no, nigga, no, we can't afford no disruption. We cannot afford instability. Yeah. We have to do that better than that. You understand? Because they have to understand everything they're doing affecting one another. When I had to teach you class the Monday, my girl, I did, I, I, for my weekend, when I come out we have nine ways, yeah. what if it just shrink? And you know what I do? I pray. I say, Lord, not down nickel. You cannot do us that second. I say, anyhow, you do that to us, it means that you want me to die, and I am going to die, and I don't think you want me to die. No, I'll be dying of emotional. So you say, you say, you say, you know, people would help us, basically? Well, and you say, like, my daughter, Minka, please, Jesus, Minka, you say, Mommy, I cannot just say a thing, I cannot just pray, I have to do things. <laughs> what I'm well, saying is, let me tell you all the faith is, let me tell you all the faith is, faith is the kind of thing, it's just positivity. If you look at faith, the same faith, but faith is something where you think positive, you know, well, and you just change your mentality on a thing, you know, my dear. Yeah. It's not about, oh, Lord, I have faith. You say you have faith, and your neighbor come, and your neighbor tell you. She do have plenty, and you have a lot, and you don't give any person, and you're there day praying, praying, praying every day in church. And then the person come and the person tell you, oh, I look that and that. First of all, the person should never feel funny. You should be so open that the person will feel funny approaching you. And then when the person comes, the person says, oh, I don't have this and that. And then you can't start saying, uh huh, how come she don't have this? And you're laughing at them, and then you're telling them, well, it's so it is, uh, you just have to work hard and pray, God will provide it, uh, and you have how much chicken in your kitchen too, and you have how much thing, and you don't have your neighbor, and you say it in your mind, you say it in your mind, well, that is a business, you look that and that and that. People mustn't do that. So that is why, why is what you're talking about earlier, you have to be together. You know? The togetherness, you understand? People have to be a little more together and they have to be together.